Hi folks, Paul here. You know what's awesome? Free batteries. A while ago I made these battery packs up for a local bicycle art collective group and they, they made 12 of them. They were very happy. They went through the whole process of getting laptop batteries, harvesting them and populating these battery packs and uh, as a thank you they have given me a box a heavy box full of laptop batteries oh lovely some of them look quite promising um, so I'm very happy about that that is awesome that is awesome you know what's awesomer what's awesomer is when someone gives you a power shelf. This monster, 48 by 7 power shelf, was built by one of my local viewers who, thank you Peter, uh, Peter H, not Peter from DIY Power Wars. Peter built this up and then got diverted by a different project. So I just finished it off put a connector on it and I'll probably end up putting my little voltmeters on it. My plan is to populate this with some of my really low capacity cells. So because this is twice the size as my previous power shelf, what I'm thinking is I will use all the really crap half capacity cells, so cells that are somewhere between 1,000 milliamp hours and 2,000 milliamp hours. I'll populate that and make myself another 1 kilowatt hour power shelf. Battery's awesome. Power shelf, awesome air. What could possibly be better? Only the awesomest. And here I have a mystery package that some of you will have seen before. All right, let me create some space and I'll open it up. All right, here we go. What is this awesomest thing? And how do I open it? Alright. Come with real, it's the next episode. Ooh. Upside down. Here we go. It is the awesomest battery charger thingy. Made by Nerdville in the UK a couple of years ago now, then used by HP Powerwall, by Fireman, and by Brad One Up The Sleeve Customs. All of those guys are on YouTube and you should check them out. I've got lots of batteries that need processing, got my power shelf that needs populating, and I've got a cool charger to get it all happening. All right. Let's plug it in. Nice. That looks good. We've got four lighting up. Now Brad, who um, sent it to me, said that he fixed a couple that were blown and the rest there's a very faint green light on these ones here so I'm guessing that these are the new ones perhaps here we go 
This is my box of 3,000 to 3,300 3, milliamp hour pairs. So they're individually just over 1,500 milliamp hours, 1,500 milliamp hours. Uh, and I think these are flat. I think they all need charging. Let's find out. Charging. 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 This looks a bit manky. Not sure about that one. Alright, there we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 4. 24 pairs charging away. Thanks a lot to Brad, Rowan, Pete, and Nerdville. This is the awesomest. Thanks a lot. Cheers. Come real, it's the next episode.